Hello and welcome. My name is Amuli and you are watching TechTube. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get most out of this expired domains .NET tool, which is freely available for everyone. You can see the interface looks not the same as you get by default when you sign up and log in for the first time. So you can see I've just customized to get more data about the domains. So you can see I'm able to see the language of the particular domain or page and then where it's getting the links from. So it's getting links from business websites. Okay. And yeah, you can see this is SCM Rush estimated traffic via google.com so if i click on it it's going to give me the highest number of traffic um, and domains are getting in from google.com this is number of keywords that are ranking on google and three keywords so these are metrics that you definitely want to look for a domain when you're going to purchase for whatever purpose now let's go ahead and see how you can get it so once you are logged in to this expired domain domains.net you go to column manager and customize it so now you can see uh, these are available metrics that you can add to your your profile and it will be by default for every search you do on this website so you can see you've got archive.org number of crawl results it's available for everybody birth this is when you uh, the website appeared on the web for the first time and was recorded by this archive.org external link majestic external links this is the number of link that a website is getting according to majestic so majestic is very up to date SEO tool it keeps records of links a website is getting like way faster than any other tools in the community then we have web uh, Wikipedia links so if any website is getting links from Wikipedia it's going to display citation flow which is again by majestic trust flow again by majestic so citation flow is your content authority which is way better than trust flow like in 2020 so if you have higher citation flow you can optimize a website and it will outrank the higher domain authority websites in many cases and here we have majestic language page language so this that's basically a language the language attribute on the web page it's uh, on the home page it's going to be displayed on every search that you do majestic topical trust flow so the colorful the color coded column for a particular domain is to tell you where a particular domain is getting links from so what industry what domain uh, what niche and that will help you decide whether this domain is right fit for your business for your blog for your niche you you are into or you want to be in SCM rush organic traffic so if any a website any URL you any domain name is getting traffic from US Google US it's going to show you and then organic keywords if any domain name is ranking for certain number of keywords it's going to display the number then I've got trust ratio which I don't find very helpful so I'm going to uncheck it so now you can get everything from here so if you're looking for anything from majestic check on it I click on it and just trust ratio was here now I do not need it um, indexed URLs Scrolled URLs, you can go ahead and check it, and this will display here. Domain path, majestic class. Uh, that's all I need. Oops. 
so I need majestic backlinks citation flow trust flow topical trust flow uh, index crawled URL and I can go ahead and simply click on this minus button and if you're looking something from SCM rush you can go rank and cost I do not need it. they are not always right AdWords monthly searches for what uh, competition you can go ahead and check this one let's see how it goes majestic million related domain SEO match geomatch so once you're happy with your selection go ahead and simply say save changes and now you can go ahead and look for domains deleted domains dot com dot net org I'm going to click on deleted domains that will that will include everything now I can go ahead and apply some filters on it so what I'm looking for anything which is available or just leave it for now I can I made it 200 domains per page I'm looking only for domains that got expired in last 12 hours okay because people are just always looking for domains uh, global LT TLDs AdWords um, I can get into Majestic and I do not need, need anything but you can just put minimum trust flow minimum citation flow so if you're putting trust flow 10 you should put citation flow 5 between 5 and 30 let's say 25 so there is a ratio let's see if trust flow is 10 you want to keep your citation flow 5 and then between 25 so minimum so you can uh, minimum has to be 5 and maximum 25 but I'm going to leave empty and I'm only looking for avail available domains within 12 hours now what I can do I can simply say I'm looking for higher citation flow websites so this is the wedding story india.com you just expired today at this time and this is GMT time I guess let me check UTC time and you can see this is, is uh, what it is tropical trust flow so tropical trust flow is higher in health and condition health conditions and diseases hmm wedding story so this is where it's getting most links from society arts and writers again health mental health shopping and clothing so if you're looking for such website I think this is really good content on the website <laughs> I don't know there's no content I think still it has 45 citation flow and the language is going to be English okay so this is how you can go with so today since a lot of people do not build the link as they used to before in most cases you will get more higher citation flow than the trust flow on the domains so let's say I'm looking for higher trust flow so this is the higher trust so this is 24 trust flow and it's getting links from recreation and travel websites 99 percent look at this okay what is this majestic indexed URLs 24 uh, crawled URL 23 so that's really good you see these are indexed URLs okay let me quickly go here 
this doesn't match always so you see number of crawled results and these are indexed URLs. so these don't match always this is why it's very useful to cross check now this just got expired today so what I will do I will just click on this and this will take you to this archive.web and I can take this URL from here and see if okay see this this says it has 1360 pages listed on Google but it hasn't okay to get more in-depth data of any particular website you definitely want to go ahead and choose any other tool like SEMrush which is good tool and it has really good interface and they have I, I think trial period as well if you want to try you can go ahead and try so that's it for this video if you have any questions suggestion leave in the comment below and I will try to answer it ASAP